welcome to another edition of This Week in YouTube, the show that would have waited in line for an iPhone if it hadn't already been in line downtown at the free clinic. Don't ask. I'm Lon Harris. And I'm Kat Steele. Our top story this week, Bristol Palin appeared in a guest spot on the popular ABC Family series, The Secret Life of an American Teenager. Plus, the visitor everyone's buzzing about. How did you know I had a baby? Bristol Palin, an all-new Secret Life, Monday at 8, 7 central. Bristol's mother, Sarah Palin, is also set to appear on a show that's based on her political career, Fringe. Bristol plans to tour the country, speaking to the young people about the dangerous consequences of getting pregnant as a teenager, like getting super famous and appearing on all of your favorite TV shows. That's going to work. Utilizing the latest in poorly lit green screen technology, Designate take us on a magical trip to the gynecologist. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, Susan, can I get a clothespin for my nose? Yeah. Yeah, thank you. Um. Oh. Do you eat a lot of garlic or fish? Destry later explained that he didn't intend for the video to be misogynist. He's just disgusted by women and their bodies. Totally different. Is there anything more annoying than a YouTube video with amateurs green screen effects? It's not that hard, people. Figure it out. This is just inappropriate. I hardly think YouTube is the place for partial nudity in rock band videos. The promotional campaign is all part of Harmonic's attempt to capture the lucrative, dirty hippie commune demographic. The video has already inspired one new trend, naked StarCraft videos. But you really don't want to see any of those guys. The sleepy town of Ekaterinburg, Russia is the birthplace of our new favorite sport. Of course, I'm talking about baby racing. <laughs> Once the babies hit 10 months old, they are too old to race in the circuit, and most are simply put out to stud. The Russian babies trained hard and are pretty tough competitors, but Sylvester Stallone still showed up at the last minute and kicked all their asses. USA! USA! The trailer for the new Green Hornet film debuted online this week. Let's take a look. Think about this, Kato. We've been completely wasting our potential. This city needs our help. We could be heroes. Here's what will make us different. We will pose as villains to get close to the bad guys. That way, no one will suspect we're really the good guys. I want you to take my hand, and I want you to come with me on this adventure. I'll go with you, but I don't want to touch you. Okay, you don't have to take my hand, but will you come with me on this adventure? Okay. Inglorious Bastards Oscar winner Christoph Waltz will play the villain in the film and every other American movie in which he's cast forever. The film is currently being converted to IMAX 3D, meaning the jokes will fly out onto the audience before crashing onto the floor and dying a painful, lonely death. John Isner and Nicholas Mahout played the longest tennis match in history at Wimbledon this week. How about crack a return? How about that? Oh, that would <laughs> be sweet. It's a pretty decent one, but good volley. Interesting side note, that YouTube clip is already the longest tennis match most Americans have ever watched. And that does it for This Week in YouTube. Be sure to check out more episodes and all of our other great shows on thisweekend.com. For Lon Harris, I'm Kat Steele watching YouTube so you don't have to.